So difference between a structure and a union in a C language. Any structure is group of elements of different data types and union is also group of elements of different data type. We use the keyword struct in structures, we use the keyword union in unions. So look at the simple uh, diagram over there. If the structure members are roll number and gender and marks, roll number integer 2 bytes, gender uh, character 1 bytes and marks float 4 bytes. The total memory allocation is 7 bytes. If the structure definition is having structure members like roll number, gender and marks, so all the three structure members are allotted different memory locations. The total memory allocation is 7 bytes. You can write a simple program for this. You can uh, put a uh, simple structure definition and use size of operator and check out the output. So where exists um, the difference is the difference in uh, memory allocation. The structure requires an amount of memory which is equivalent to sum of the size of all the members. Whereas the amount of memory required to store a union is always equal to that required by the member which occupies highest number of bytes that is the largest uh, member. So look at this diagram, uh, unions, uh, this diagram is of unions. So memory will be allotted to the one which occupies more number of bytes, so that is marks float 4 bytes and within the same memory location the other members will be adjusted. So in structure each member has their own memory space while in a union, a single block is used by all the members of the union. So in structures, if you make changes to one value in any structure, it will not affect the other members. In union, altering any one value of any number will affect the other member values. We can access all the members at a time and we can store uh, all the members at a time in case of structures, whereas in case of unions only one member can be accessed at any given time and only one a member of union can be initialized at a time. So we'll see a few differences, structure is user defined data type, union also user defined data type and we use the keyword struct and here union. And we use structures um, to represent a record and union allows storing different data types in the same memory location. The size is very important here. The total size of uh, the entire structure variable is sum of all the members. In the previous example, we just observed it 7. The same notation, if you use it using union, we get only 4. So, whatever the example I have shown in the diagram, just put it as a program. You just put main and a structure definition, create a structure variable and use a printf statement with size of operator. So, each member has its own memory space that is important in structures whereas only one block is used by the, all the members of the union. So we can store all the members at a time, we can initialize everything at a time in case of structures whereas only one can be initialized, one can be accessed in case of unions. The difference between a structure and union, we will see some demo programs. Look at the demo of our structure. Look at line number 5, structure definition 5 to 10, 
What is the name of the structure? Book. What are the members? B code, B pages, and B price. And what is the structure variable here? B1. So size of operator. We are using size of operator to determine how many bytes a structure variable occupies. So if you execute the program, so we get the output as 7, a character 1 byte, an integer 2 bytes and float 4 bytes. And no confusion uh, regarding the output here, uh, you may get a different output if you work on uh, different compilers. Some compilers uh, takes integer as uh, 4 bytes. So in, uh, if you work this in a traditional uh, C environment, like a turbo C, you get 7. The same program using unions. The keyword struct is replaced by the term union. Look at the thing here. And in this program, uh, we get the output as 4. Because in unions, memory will be allocated to the union variable based on the union member so here b price occupies more number of bytes among all the union members so four bytes will be allocated 